Hi, this is Teacher Tess again. Welcome to another session of English Interview for Stewardesses.、Like、Our questions today are related to interests and hobbies. The interviewer is interested about the other side of you. So in this part, just be yourself. Answer the question with confidence. One of the possible questions that might be given to you is, "What kind of books do you like?" Or, "Can you tell me about a book that has impressed you?" So, in this question, it asks you about. Um, a book that you like to read, or a book that really interests you. Now let's read a sample answer. I like all kinds of books. I think it depends on the mood I am in. Sometimes I like to read romance, sometimes mysteries, and sometimes even non-fiction about our past. A book I have. Read recently was called Kite Runner. It is the true story that talked about friendship and deception. While、well, her answer is said here that she likes to read books, but it depends on her mood. Okay, sometimes romance, mysteries, or sometimes nonfiction. Now let's read the sample answer here again. I am not a bookworm, but sometimes I love reading suspense story. I love suspense story because it is not boring and so hard to predict the ending. Now I guess you already have an idea on how to answer this question. All you need to do now is to copy the question and also the sample answers. Then try to answer this question using your own words. Now, let's have another question. Well, the last question that I gave you was about the book that you like to read. Now this is the follow-up questions. Can you tell me about the story? So just make it sure if you want to give a book. Okay, just make it sure that you know the story. Okay. So this is a sample answer. This was a true story about two Afghani children. One was the master's son, and the other was a slave's son. They grew up as best friend until one day, Amir, the master's son, sees Hassan, the slave's son, get raped by some local bullies, but is too afraid to say anything to stop them. Amir can't live with himself for this, so decides he will get Hassan's family to leave through making the master think. That the family has stolen things, and at the end, Amir grows up, goes back to Afghanistan to find out that Hassan and his wife have been killed by the Taliban. At this time, he also finds out that Hassan was actually his half brother. Amir checks down Hassan's young buddy, adopts him, and brings him back to America. The story moved me to tears many times. Well, in this answer, she summarized the story. Well, I want you to copy the question now and also the sample answers. But well, actually, this is not really. You don't need to answer this one, okay? Because this is another story. So if you have your book there, just make it sure that you know how to summarize it. Now let's move on to the next question. 
now our question today is also a follow-up question about the story okay so tell me what you learned from a recent book or it can be tell me what you learned from that book okay it's like that so just make it sure that you know the lesson or the moral of the story now let's read a sample answer a book i read recently was about segregation between black and white people in a, in the american school system i learned that racism can occur in all areas of the world and through all ages from young to old now let's read the other sample answer the last book I read was the story of a man and a woman. They fell in love, but some circumstances separated them. They had lots of trials, but in the end they so ended up together. This just means that true love really works. Now students, I know you're smiling this time because you already have an idea on how to answer the following questions. This time, I want you to get your pen and paper, copy the question and also the sample answer. Well, please remember that practice makes perfect, so please try to practice answering the three questions. Well, students, please remember that you don't need to memorize your answer. Just practice answering the questions, but don't memorize. Thank you so much for being with me, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.